Hello, I'm Adam Barillet and welcome to this Crystal Connections video where we're exploring the crystal Tremolite. Now Tremolite comes in many various colours but today we're exploring this green one that's often coloured by chrome and thus sometimes called chrome Tremolite. It's found in a similar location to Tanzanite in Tanzania and thus has a real high vibration. Now you hear this saying about crystals being high, vibra high vibration crystals but what do we mean by that? Well, everything has a frequency or a vibration. You know, and humans vibrate somewhere between 62 and 78 when we're healthy. So what happens is high vibration crystals help lift us towards that 78, help us to find balance physically, mentally, emotionally, and spiritually. And when we are working with these crystals, well, the eventual outcome is that we feel content, balanced, and happy. So green tremolite really works bringing the heart chakra into balance and really helps to expand that heart chakra and deal with issues of the heart. So we're going to look at how you can use your tremolite to really sit there and work with this. Now this is not a crystal you're going to want to work with you know, and wear on a regular basis. You're going to want to take time to sit down and really enjoy it and feel the effects of it and then really kind of reflect on what the results of working with this crystal has been. This is one you're going to use in meditations and healings to get great results quickly and profoundly. The relationships and the dynamics within the family unit can have a profound effect on our well-being and Tremolite helps to heal that. If there is any type of dysfunction in the family then use Tremolite to bring up the issues and to actually help you to deal with them. Now if what it will help you to do is help you first of all to become conscious of any dysfunction in the family, realize the role that you played as well as the roles that other people played and also work out how that has actually caused cause you to grow into the beautiful person that you are. It can help you to actually rewrite the story and so that you don't carry this dysfunction on into the future. Tremolite is a really great crystal for denial. So if you're in denial about a dysfunction in a family relationship or a current relationship that you're in or denying anything at all then Tremolite will really help you to deal with that and to admit and face that what's actually happening in that case. Now it's really good also for helping to protect the heart. So if you find that because of past relationships, whether it be family or romantic relationships, you tend to get a bit anxious or panicky, then again Tremolite will help to stabilise those feelings so that you don't actually feel so disempowered in that way. Some great pairings to actually help with this healing can be pair Tremolite with Malachite. Now Malachite rips issues up really really quickly so if you want something you know like ripping the band-aid off if you want that type of effect then Tremolite and Malachite will be really good together. If you want a bit of a softer approach and you want to bring things up subtly then pairing it with Ocean Jasper. Ocean Jasper has a real gentle approach to it and even if you've done some healing work with Tremolite Ocean Jasper can be a nice crystal for the person whether it be yourself or someone else that you're working with to carry afterwards to allow that healing to kind of gently settle in and let that person recalibrate. Now a lot of the time our relationships with our family can affect our breathing and Tremolite has been found to be really useful in all different breathing disorders. You know asthma can often happen when someone has felt smothered by love and they're unable to breathe and so pairing Tremolite with Aquamarine which really helps with breathing and allowing us to breathe can help with asthma. Bronchitis is caused when there is an inflammation kind of situation in the family. So if you've got a very angry family if there's lots of fighting then that can often result in bronchitis and again Tremolite and Aquamarine can be great for that. The other one is emphysema. Now emphysema is normally a fear of taking in life, you know feeling resistant because of what's happening in, um, in the family unit or around you in other relationships, also not feeling worthy of living. And if that's the case, tremolite and either aquamarine to allow the breathing but also falling back in love with life, so pairing tremolite with mold white can be really really powerful as well. Many have found that Tremolite really helps with the brain and creating new pathways. So after we've dealt with all that rubbish and got rid of that, we want to bring in new ways of being. So it can help the brain to rewrite and rewire new effective habits and ways of being and thought patterns and really help you to kind of follow them and stay focused on them. So if you've done some healing, if you've got rid of some stuff with in the past, then Tremolite will help to keep you on track. Because it's a high vibration crystal as well, it'll also lift you up to those higher realms and allow you to connect with ancestral knowledge, with spiritual kingdoms, with all spiritual beings, angels, whatever you really resonate with. If you want to bring that information down, then Tremolite will help you to connect up with that. So sit peacefully with your Tremolite. Allow yourself to really kind of connect with it and then just allow those guides to come into your meditation. Allow them to whisper in your ear. Allow that guidance to come however you find it to be most effective in the past. 
being a green crystal, green tremolite is really going to help us with our heart chakra. And because it's high vibration, once that chakra is balanced, we can actually start to expand that chakra and kind of go to deeper and deeper levels when it comes to love, and when it comes to valuing other people and valuing the gifts of the universe. Tremolite helps you to truly understand another's heart's desire. And isn't that more is there not a more beautiful gift than that and really being able to understand what someone truly wants and be able to resonate understand that and even help to guide them towards experiencing that true desire this is such a beautiful crystal when it comes to working with the heart that it can really be great when you're dealing with people like in long term uh, long distance relationships it can expand that heart's reach for even further if you've got a partner that works away or is you're in a long distance relationship then work with tremolite hold it and visualize that person and really feel that connection if you've got two pieces have them carry one and you carry one this can be really great as well it's also great when we have friends that are moving away. A piece of tremolite can help us to send love to them and we can even give a piece to them to, so that they remember us and that we're always with them and always considering their heart and their happiness. So wherever you're working with your heart and expanding your reaches of what your heart can do and opening up your love to bigger and bigger capacities, tremolite is going to be with you every step of the way to helping that experience and to filling your heart with more love, compassion and oh, just pure bliss really. It's a magical crystal still like that. So we've discussed that tremolite helps to stabilize shaky environments and helps to flood it with love and bring new pathways and more stability. And so this is really great whenever there is any instability in your life. If you need to stabilize things and flood it with love, then work with tremolite. Now tremolite has been used in in scenarios or environments or situations where it's chaotic or could possibly be chaotic. Now if you find that there's a bit of chaos about to come, maybe something's going to happen at work, there has been a kind of tragedy, then reach for your tremolite to bring in that stability and help you rise above it and act with love. On occasions, people have used it to help stabilize natural environments, especially where they're prone to a volcanic eruptions or earthquakes. Now you can try this, but I do give you a word of warning here. It is not our job to change the environment and to change Mother Nature. She is perfect at finding her own balance. So if you are going to use Tremolite for stabilizing, you know, from earthquakes or volcanoes, think wisely about this. Is this what Mother Nature would want? And only do that if you think the answer is yes. To make the most out of Tremolite, let's bring in some other energies to really bring it to its utmost. This is a stabilizing, heart-bound crystal that really helps to make strong, long connections in loving relationships. And so, it resonates really well with the earth element. So when you're going to cleanse your Tremolite, place it on the earth. And you can see around me here, there's some beautiful flowers. And so this would be a great place to place it because flowers help to lift a vibration even higher. So if you can place it on the earth, um, Careful burying it. If it's a raw piece, you may not want to bury it. So just place it on the earth. And if there's some flowers around, that's a really nice place. Even somewhere that's really ultra natural will be a great place to cleanse your tremolite. Just leave it there for as long as you can. Now, what else can you bring in to work with your tremolite? Meditate and draw in the energy of different animal guides for all different crystals. And for tremolite, I use the green macaw. These beautiful parrots are this expression of that heart chakra, of that abundance, of that love, and really help you to truly express love to the world and not to, be, not to hold back when that happens. So look at a, invite a green macaw into meditations. Feel the energy of a green macaw. Become the green macaw when working with your tremolite. The plant I like to use when I'm working with Tremolite is Palm Rosa, and I love working with the essential oil. Now this is such a heart chakra essential oil. It's been used and has, can still be used for love amulets and love spells to bring love into your life. It really can help you to find a lover, a lover that's really going to resonate with you and understand your true heart's desire. Because it's a long grass and it's kind of it's like blades of swords, it can cut away any unhealthy attachments, any hurt or any suffering from past relationships that stop you from moving on and finding a bigger, better and more embracing, loving partner than you could ever possibly imagine. So you really want to work with your palm rosa when you're wanting to bring new love into your life, heal the hurts of the past and your tremolite. Those two together will work magically. Astrologically, I find Tremolite works beautifully with the planet Venus, and thus Venus rules Friday, and Friday is going to be the best day to work with your Tremolite. Have you worked with Tremolite? I'd love to hear about your experiences with it, and so would the rest of our crystal-loving community. So please, if you have, share a comment in the section below. You'll also see down there, you can subscribe to my video channel and find out lots of different things about all of nature's gifts that I like to share with you each and every week. 
Thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video. I'm Adam Barrelow. Blessed be.